So if I can hand over to Darren, um, just talk you through about the actual housing product. <coughs> Hi, so I'm, I'm Darren Brooks, I'm Technical Manager at Waco UK. I'm just going to run through the product. Now, as, as David alluded to, for two years I was tasked with coming up with, with a new product. I'm going to call it a system as such. Come up with a system that was designed for manufacture, which was easy for the guys on the shop floor to, to erect, but also had many different um, areas which could be used. So, Ministry of Defence, Student Accommodation, House and Market. So in essence, the module is made up of six panels. You have a floor, you have a roof, and four wall panels. And the house that you're going to see outside is made up of two modules. So it's light gauge steel, 1.6 gauge, very lightweight, and also sits with the foundations that you'd be putting down. So rather than having a, a raft, we, we, we would reckon you'd be using, depending on subjects and ground conditions, looking at a strip footing around the perimeter of the module. I've got some key points on there, but I think I've just described them. So the fabric of the building. We went for a fabric which meets the requirements. So flexibility. David has already alluded, alluded to what we can do in terms of the external facade, whether it's traditional brick on site, whether it's a render, whether it's a trespass. We've got that flexibility. All our steelwork is designed by a structural engineer so we can tailor it to suit the requirements of your needs. Just touching again on the flexibility, we have no standard module sizes. We're not going to come to you and say you've got a three metre grid that you're fixed to. We can tailor it to suit your requirements. So if there's a house that was four metres, 856, we'll tailor that to your requirements. The only restrictions that we do find are the transportation restrictions that we come across. So if there's a tight site access or road bridges, so there's restriction just due to transportation, but, but beyond that, we can tell it to your needs. Um, I've got there design as well in for easy future internal remodeling. So it's a single span module that we've got in there. All the walls are number bearing. We can tailor them, we can chop and change. If you wanted a remodeling at a later stage, if it's social housing and you want to add an additional room, we've got the flexibility to do that. We've got pop up, pop out floors if you want to put a, a lift in there at a later stage. Bring it down to the lifetime homes. The 16 points for lifetime homes, we, we cover all, all in bases. There's a couple which as developers you'd have to take on board in terms of the easy access and the car parking. But where it falls within our remit, we've got that covered first. The demonstration house that you're going to see out there is based on the HCA standards. So what but we've gone just a little bit bigger, we've gone to 87 square metres rather than the 82 to 85. And I, I feel you'll, you'll feel that difference when you go into the demonstration house. The elements of the build, at least a minimum, five main elements achieve the BRE at a grade of B or above. The reason I've, I say that because the floor BRE don't quite recognise the floor, a suspended steel floor construction at the moment. So going forward, we hope that would be taken on board by the BRs. And I'll leave it there, but if, if you're with me as I walk around, I can answer any questions and we're doing a Q&A later on as well. Thanks, sir.